So one of the most controversial things nowadays is that everybody always has your location at like all time. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you an app that you can download on your phone that allows you to change your location to trick your friends into thinking you're somewhere else or to unlock exclusive content in different games. The people over at i2lab actually asked me if I wanted to review their AnyGo software. And I said that I'd be more than happy to because I've been looking for a software like this for myself and other ones that I've used have been slightly unreliable. So we're going to put this one to the test and see how it actually performs. The link to download everything will be down below in the description but with all that being said like comment subscribe and let's get this downloaded all right so i'm on my phone right now and this is the link that i have down below in the description so this is actually the page we're just going to press download now so we'll actually be prompted with this installation thing we're just going to click on install and then from there if we go to our thing we can see that we actually have this downloading right here now from there we can see the next piece of instruction is to go to our settings general vpn device management and actually add the vpn profile right here so we're gonna do that now we're just gonna press trust press trust and just like that we should be good and then here are the instructions to actually download it on our desktop device so let me switch on over to my computer and we're actually gonna follow along to these steps all right so now what we're gonna do since we're on desktop we're gonna press free download just like this and actually go to the download right here and we're going to download the Windows 11 version and just actually download this to wherever we want to on our computer. And we're going to go like that. So we can quickly see just the process of what this what this actually has to offer. We can see that they refer to themselves as the safest spoofer for iOS and Android devices. Three modes to help you fake your location more naturally. You can customize the speed, pause at any time, customize cycle times, cooldown timers, import GPX files, which I'm sure is like GPS location. You can like preset where you want to move and when. And that shows all the compatible apps. So we got Snapchat, Life360, Tinder, WhatsApp, Instagram, Facebook, Bumble, Pokemon Go, all these other games. And and that's pretty much that. Now we can see that we can spoof the location of multiple phones by connecting through the app. So that's why it's important that you download it on your iOS device. And you can actually control by just using a GPS or the keys on your keyboard, which is super interesting and not a lot of platforms actually offer this. All right, so now we actually have the software running. We're setting it up and we're just gonna do agree. And just like that, it should be installed. But the cool thing about AnyGo for me is that it's wireless and it only requires a Wi-Fi connection. So that's kind of an interesting concept. So we're going to press finish right here, let it finish installing. And just like that, we actually have it ready to go. All right. So from here, we're actually just going to go to iOS. We are going to pick the device to connect to. So we're just going to click on this here. We're going to go to next. And let me quickly show you, I have my device screen unlocked and it is currently downloading. All right. So now you can see my phone is finally connected. We have it connected to the computer. All we're going to do now, now from there, we're going to follow the instructions on the computer itself. So we're going to go into our settings we're going to go to our privacy and security scroll down to developer mode then we're just going to activate it and it's going to make us restart our phone so we're going to click on that and then we got to let it restart and obviously our device is disconnected now because it's in the process of restarting and we're just going to let it restart all right so we actually have the software connected on the phone and on the computer right now we're actually just going to allow while using i'm going to quickly change my location to like somewhere random before showing you guys how it works i'm just going to quickly like change my location to somewhere random. okay so right now i actually have my location changed to like this random spot at this like high school almost and we can see just from the computer app that's actually where we have it located to now if we were to change this we could literally go to wherever we want let me quickly show you where my location shows up inside of Pokemon Go. So right now we are like in a completely random location. I promise you this is not like where my house is, but let's just say that if we were, okay. sorry, just had to capture that one real quick. This honestly works super well and it's super easy to set this up. We actually got out, we're gonna capture him again. Oh, we got him. Oh, finally. Jeez. Now we can see that my location is right here. We're near like this little park area right here, which is that high school I was talking about before. Now, if we look on over to our location on the um, desktop, we can see that I'm going to change my location to like a random place in China. So my location's changed now. We literally just see on the app, it has changed us there. So I'm going to have to zoom in real quick. But we can see that we're literally in the middle of nowhere. That we've just we've just teleported there, which is absolutely crazy. Now, if we were to use our joystick right here, we can see that we're like walking. It shows us walking. Now, if we stop, wait a sec, we stop. So like, dude, this is really like broken. We can also change the speed of us walking. So we can see that we're like running, but 
dude this is just ridiculous how this works oh my gosh we're like sprinting right now dude but basically that's how that actually works but yeah that's the software itself and honestly it definitely serves the function of changing your location there's a lot of different choices in terms of using a joystick clicking to move around changing the speed there's just a lot of functionality in the software itself which is always great to see but if you guys want to download it on your own phone and your own computer go check out the two links at the top of the description massive shout out to the people over at i2 lab for actually making this video possible any questions you guys have leave them down below i'll be sure to answer all of them i'll see you guys later peace out